Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channeled messages reading from your person for all of my Aquariuses who are watching. So if you have Aquarius as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Aquarius, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get started with your reading, Aquarius, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Aquarius, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Alright, Aquarius, so first what we'll do is pull some of my channel messages to get started with the energy that is coming towards you. You could be dealing with this energy already, Aquarius, but let's go ahead and get started. Let's see what we have going on for Aquarius when it comes to love. What energy do we have for Aquarius, please, when it comes to love? Who's this person that Aquarius is dealing with, please? All right, so we have four cards to start out with. Let's go ahead and get two more specific messages, please. One more card. What else do we need to know for now for my Aquariuses? Okay, Aquarius, so as you can see, we do have our first few cards here. Before I do show them and get into your energy, please keep in mind that any energy, feelings, emotions, actions that I'm describing from your person, that could be how you feel. The roles could be reversed. Just however this reading resonates for you, please only take what resonates out of this reading. All right, Aquarius, so let's see what we have. We have, I won't ever judge you. I'm not asking for much, but I need this to feel real. How can I show you that I love you? We also have, I trusted my head, not my heart. I'm so in love with you. This is the best I have ever felt. And I'm picky, but it's like you were made for me. You're exactly what I want. Excuse the typo if you do notice it but I'm picky but it's like you were made for me you're exactly what I want so Aquarius I feel like there is someone and this could actually be a mutual energy like a mirroring energy between you two but I do feel like there is someone who is in a way hiding how much they feel towards you and it could come off as this person being distant them being shy or even them like you it, it comes off as like this person isn't even like showing like they're showing that they're interested in you Aquarius like someone who is really playing it cool but it, it comes off in a way nonchalant so of course Aquarius take it how it resonates for you as far as you sensing this person's energy but I feel like this person feels more for you than they do show um, but in order for you two to come together, this person is going to need to not second guess themselves, not second guess their actions, just just naturally show how they feel and not not put up a front because it's like you can sense that Aquarius and that might be turning you off. Like, is this person acting like they're too good to just show me their, their true selves? their true self excuse me if that makes sense it's not like you're you're being like pushy like show me how you feel about me like right away instantly it's like depending on if this person is coming off with an attitude or if they're being nonchalant if they're coming off careless towards you I feel like you take that personally Aquarius all right so um 
it's like this person is hiding how much um, they feel about you or how you spark their emotions. And like I said, Aquarius, that might be turning you off. Um, I feel like your energy, you've been mirroring their energy, but you have shown them that you're into them. You're getting to know them for a reason. You wouldn't know them if, or you wouldn't put yourself into this connection if you weren't genuinely interested in this person. We have, I won't ever judge you. I feel like this is your energy, Aquarius. Of course, this might have its limitations, but if there is something this person is embarrassed about, something that they're ashamed of, like you're open, you're willing to hear it out. Like, at least tell me or give me the truth or let me hear it from you so I could readjust or know what to expect but you being silent about everything you being nonchalant like that's just making me become deterred or um, be pushed back or it's allowing me to become detached because it's not feeling like we're getting anywhere there's no substance here we have I'm not asking for much but I need to feel this is real your energy Aquarius it might not feel like this is something real for you as far as you two really growing something here this person putting in their their real intentions or showing their real intentions towards you so it doesn't all have to come at once but let's at least make baby steps let's let's have some progress here we have i trust in my head not my heart i feel like this is this person's energy they're in their head right now aquarius they're not leading with their heart maybe there's some ego involved. They they want to, like, in a way, put up this tough front or persona so they they make themselves appear better. Um, maybe this is a person who is not used to showing their vulnerability or their vulnerable side. And that might be uncomfortable for you as well, Aquarius. You, It might not be the easiest, but if we're getting to know one another and love is the objective, then you can't be so shy about it. Like you, you have to like open up and like take the baby steps at least. And maybe it's hard for you, Aquarius. So the fact that you've shared with this person some tough parts or yeah, some tough things within or about yourself, it's like, you can at least give me that same courtesy that I, that I've gave you. So it's like, they might be denting this connection because you've been vulnerable. They have not and you're understanding or you have been, but at this point it's coming off like they, they don't care as much as you do. But I feel like this person is stepping up here. Like they're, they're finally like taking charge or taking action we have i'm picky but it's like you were made for me you're exactly what i want especially if you have backed off aquarius like you have became more uninterested because of how this person is being um it's like they don't want you to get away aquarius and i feel like if you have been silent towards them they they sense that and they could tell that perhaps their actions or how their being is deterring you from this connection I'm so in love with you. This is the best I have ever felt. I feel like this is this person's energy. Of course, with you and this person knowing one another, it doesn't have to reach you two being in love just yet, but I feel like you you access a certain part within this person's heart, Aquarius. Like You are the one that they are interested in and the one that they feel like is worth pursuing. And it's it's because of how you make them feel even if they're trying to subdue that feeling and we have how can i show you that i love you i feel like this is this person's energy towards you aquarius them wanting to make up for their absence or them slacking or just their feelings towards you coming off as unknown they want to make up for that let's get a few more messages, please, for Aquarius. What else do we need to know here? Let's get two more messages, please. One more card for Aquarius, please. 
Okay, Aquarius, the last card that did come out is I want to show you how much I love you. We have, you've got my full attention and you're an amazing person and I want you to know that. So yeah, Aquarius, for you, I feel like you don't know how this person feels and this is why you started not to care because it's like you've put your, your hands out there and this person hasn't even like attempted to reach towards you yet. So, so it's like you, you may honestly not even know how this person feels towards you if they're just keeping you around for their leisure or like, it's like from your perspective, you don't know where this person sees you in their life and you want to make relationships with intention, with substance. We have, you're an amazing person and I want you to know that. I feel like deep down this is how this person feels towards you, Aquarius. But you might be backing off because they don't treat you like this. And that's, that's completely right, Aquarius. Like, validate your own emotions and just know that you could have the love that you, you want for yourself, that you visualize for yourself. And if a person isn't doing that, and you abide by how you feel, and if that means walking away, a person who knows good enough would would fix their actions and try to make things right with you. At least that's how I, I think of it. Of course, only take what resonates for you, Aquarius. We do have, you've got my full attention. I feel like this is also their energy, Aquarius, but now's the time to show this, like let it be known here and seems like they are I want to show you how much I love you so this person finally stepping up and taking action towards you let's see what situations oracle cards we have Aquarius let's get a few cards for Aquarius please when it comes to this connection what other energy might be relevant for Aquarius please First card, we do have irreconcilable differences, divorce final. So this could be a person from the past or maybe you two, like how I've been describing you backing away from this person. Maybe you you made that decision because this person wasn't meeting you halfway. Irreconcilable differences, like you two weren't seeing eye to eye here. So you had to just cut it off. And this is also a person like... a accommodating or matching your love language as well if they're failing to get it or failing to show you that they love you then that could be a, a difference in itself as well let's get another card for aquarius please let's see what this is we have negotiator bargaining begging so aquarius i feel like you're not about to beg for this person's love even negotiating like for you it's like you put your love out there plain plain or clear clearly to this person like they knew it was out there but they didn't come for or come towards it so it's like you're not doing anything else like you, you can't beg this person for your love also as you can see there's like it's a water fountain sometimes water fountains like they only give you so little and you keep pressing like the button for more to come out like so it's like the amount of effort you're doing compared to how much you're getting out of the fountain like is it worth it let's go ahead and get one more card please for aquarius we have tragedy forbidden love so this may have not been the person for you aquarius and that's where some people fumble when they try to put up a persona or a front or they play hard to get Sometimes it's intentional, sometimes it's not intentional, but say it, say this person was waiting for you to chase after them, but you're done, like you're, you only get one chance with Aquarius. This person may have fooled themselves out of, out of your love. Let's see what sign you might be dealing with Aquarius. We do have Sagittarius. Capricorn, let's get one more sign, please, for Aquarius, please, and Cancer. All right, 
Aquarius. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.